What's going on? It's Kev Obato, and I'm back with another Botticera and Retro Bat theme review. In today's theme review, we're going to be reviewing Tech Dweeb from YouTube's theme review. Now, you may have never seen his channel, but you probably have if you're into tech. And I'm subscribed, and I enjoy watching it. You know me. Let's not waste any time, and let's get right into the theme review. All right, so you know during the theme review, we just go through, kind of show off how the menus look. We kind of show off how the main screen looks. And then we look for specific collections that a lot of themes don't have. Now, a lot has changed since I used to do theme reviews. Now, most themes do have Switch. Some still don't, but most do. Now, a lot of themes don't have PlayStation 4. So... In all videos going forward, we're gonna be looking for the PlayStation 4 collection to decide, hey, is that theme really up to par? Does it get the Kev Obato points? And calling these theme reviews is really a stretch. I just kind of go through the theme and show it off. But oh, look at that, there's Switch there. And it's a really cool looking icon. So very quickly, one thing we also like to check is by default, does the theme support videos? And yeah. it supports videos. So he's getting all the points he needs. This is a good theme and it's super basic. If you like simple themes, this might just be right up your alley. And also this is geared more towards handhelds. I can just tell from the pixel, like the pixelated, you know, style of it. It doesn't look great on big screens because like on my 32 inch monitor here, I can see every single pixel. <laughs> but I know once I watch the video back on my phone, it's gonna look super nice because it's gonna be a smaller screen. Anyways, we'll go through and just check out the rest of this theme. Once we do that, I'll show you where you can download it. And I'll show you a couple of the theme configuration settings because there are a few, including changing like the color scheme. I might as well go in and show you all the colors because why not? Um, another thing here is we're getting close. Here's PS3. What are you guys thinking? What are we thinking? Here we go. Boom. <laughs> it's got it. Cool deal. All right. So Tech Dweeb did put the PS4 collection in his theme. So that's awesome to see. He's got, I mean, he's got Switch. He's got PS4. I already know he's got their Steam there. So he's good. He's in the game. He's got themes for all of the current systems. One thing very quickly I will say is while I was working on a video that's coming out really soon called Retrobat versus Botticera, I found out that the themes downloader here on Botticera, it's very slow. On Retrobat, it's like fat. It's, it's as fast as your internet is. I could download five themes in Retrobat and the time it took me to download one in Botticera, like the same one. So these videos are good for anyone who maybe doesn't want to wait an hour to download a theme from Botticera. You can check it out here. And obviously this theme is very lightweight, so it shouldn't take a long time, even in Botticera. But I'd still bet that you could get through at least some of this video before it gets done. So, and I don't know why that is, but it's not that big of a deal. Just, it just makes these videos more useful because if you can go and, you know, quickly search and check out the theme visually without having to download it and waste your time, hey, that's what I'm here for. Future Editor Kev here. I was doing a little bit of research and I found the GitHub for this theme. Looks like multiple people have worked on it. In the video, I say, Tech dweeb, tech dweeb, tech dweeb. But a couple of other people worked on it as well. And one little thing I thought was hilarious was this. Of all the emulation station themes you could have downloaded, you chose this one. I hope you're proud of yourself. <laughs> and we've made our way back to Xbox 360. So now I'll go in and show you where to download it. Once we go into themes, you'll go down to the bottom. And it's Tech Dweeb right there. So I'll leave that on the screen for a second so you can see it. Check it out. You Maybe you already have checked it out. Let me know what you think about it in the comments below. For anyone still watching, I know the theme reviews usually aren't this long. But let's go in and check out the theme configuration settings. There aren't many here. We can change the game list view, which we will. Well, let's do it. Let's change the game list view. Fuck it. 
Oh, okay, 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 okay. So that was the games list view. You can change that to a couple of different things. And really, I wouldn't mess with that. I like, I like the way it's set up, but if you want to mess with it, you can. The one thing I will mess with is the color scheme. So here you got a bunch of colors, orange stuff, purple slime, aqua slush, green ooze, pink fluff, blue goo, <laughs> red squish, gray gunk. <laughs> Ew, gray gunk. That just, oh my gosh, that just rolls off of the tongue in a not great way. D, <laughs> DG Dungeon and Custom Chaos, which I think you can actually change yourself. I'm not going to get into that today, but we can check out Purple Slime, Aqua Slush, Green Ooze. Okay, I like this. We got pink fluff. I like that. That's dope. Blue goo. Red squish. And gray gunk. DMD dungeon. To support tech dweeb, we'll go back to orange. We'll keep it orange. I think that's right. I think that's only right that we keep it orange. So, anyways, that's going to wrap up today's video. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them in the comments below. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe. Come on. I'm still a new YouTuber. Help me out. Anyways, I'll catch you in the next video. It's Kev Obato signing out. Is everybody gone? Is it just us? Okay, great. Now, usually my theme review videos don't get very many views. So I want to gift one of you a free Botticera drive. So once again, these videos usually only get a thousand or so views at the most. And the chances of someone listening this far in the video are slim. So instead of it being hundreds of entries, like in the last video, there'll probably only be a few. So. You can comment anything in the comment section. Like the video and comment down below and you will be entered for the giveaway. Comment anything, doesn't even matter. Those are the rules. All you gotta do is comment and I will pick one of you to win a 500 gigabyte preloaded game drive free of charge. No shipping, no nothing, sent straight to your door. I appreciate everybody that's got this far and everybody that's listening, and I wish you the best of luck, and I hope that you win. Now, the video is really over. You can go, and I'll see you in the next video.